accompanying him on the tabla, India's Shafat Khan. saying that uh, I feel uh, privileged to be participating in the first South Asian festival for Sark countries, Sark countries. And I feel that this is the dawn of a new era where we shall be able to have used this particular platform to have cultural exchange and interaction between artists of the Sark countries. And I would also like to say that I'm, I was very happy when it was proposed by my government, Pakistan, and, and the Indian government that in the spirit of Sark, myself and Ustad Shafat Ahmed Khan should play together in the spirit of Sark with the intention of creating harmony together. And uh, it's been wonderful um, going all over India and I'm particularly excited about Delhi as everyone is. And uh, to start with, I would like to I would like to start off with a raga called Yemen. Thank you very much.
<coughs> Thank you very much. Um, well, there was a slight power of failure, which almost failed my heart. <laughs> you know? Um, but uh, because what happens is that I'd like to, in the meantime, tell you. In the meantime, I'd like to tell you something about my, my instrument, the electric piano. Um, <clears throat> why the electric piano and not any other instrument? I mean, especially an instrument from this part of the world. Basically, because, uh, because I can't play any other instrument. <laughs> is the truth. <laughs> and uh, well, I'm basically a pianist. I, I, I carry the keyboards f more for the convenience, because the piano is very difficult to transport around. And uh, the electric piano, the piano in general, I would like to say is I feel that uh, the piano is one of the most versatile instruments in the world. The reason being that it has managed to it has managed to stay with us for many centuries. It has managed to lend itself to Western classical music in the beginning. Um, it's managed to lend itself to Western classical music. Uh, it was there, it was used in this particular form. It was there. Then times changed, music changed, but it was, the piano was still there. You had jazz, you had you had ragtime music, you had Dixie music. The piano was still there. The technique basically changed. You took away all the sustain, and you had a very honky-tonk, a very uh, jazzy kind of a piano in this form. I felt that uh, I, I wanted to, since I was fascinated by, by, uh, by Eastern classical music, I wanted to play it also. And uh, it was too late for me to start another instrument. And so therefore I began, I decided to stick to my, my instrument. I did some research and uh, discovered that the piano belongs to the same musical family as the santur, which comes from Kashmir. And, um, so I decided that I wanted to listen and study the techniques of the Santur. And for this, uh, Pandit Shiv Kumar Sharmaji was very, very helpful to me. He, um, he told me, since you know, he's the father of the Santur, um, he told me a lot of the intricacies of the technique of the Santur. And uh, I then listened to that and uh, got a hold of my instrument, saw what were the peculiarities of my instrument, Combine them with certain, uh, combine them with the, the the techniques of the santur, and then we came up with this. Basically, came up with the sound that you heard just now. Um, however, um, I would also like to today play you something that uh, I, I I composed, which is a bit of a fusion between Western classical uh, piece that I have written and uh, uh, Eastern classical music from the subcontinent, and uh, that it goes something like this. Thank you.
I'm going to try another one. I'm really being very rebellious tonight. <laughs> If you just give me... Uh, a minute or so. Sorry, yes, I will. Um, basically, uh, I use the sound of the electric piano from, from this instrument. This, most of these are, um, well, Japanese uh, instruments, this one being an American one. And um, various other sounds I, I, I take from uh, this particular instrument that you're going to hear. Very, it has some very nice wind instruments, uh, sounds of wind instruments. And uh, <coughs> my control nerve unit is, is over here. My, I have drums, I have sound processors, I have <coughs> mixers, I have a hard disk drive also. And um, now the next, uh, the next particular piece that I wish to play for you is, uh, you see, one, one major question that comes in when you're, playing, uh, when you're playing this particular instrument is that how can you, how can you, uh, how can you tackle the question of mind and kamak, which is a very major part of, of our music. And uh, well, I've devised uh, a method of of trying to solve this this question, and uh, I would like to um, through this next piece um, try and ex exhibit what uh, the potential of mean and hamak is in, through these particular instruments.
was The Wizard on the Electric Piano from Pakistan. Adnan Sami Khan was accompanied on the tabla by Shafat Khan of India.